Well, if your Father's Day weekend plans include outdoor activities, it should be a good weekend as we take a look outside to our Weatherbug Network, Swickley Academy in the North Hills. Some of that early morning fog already burning off, just some light winds, clear skies. That's because we're under this area of high pressure, which is parked pretty much over central West Virginia. That is going to slide off to the south and the east, allowing our next weather maker, which is currently situated over northern Missouri and southern Iowa, to slide our way. And that's going to set the stage for another round of severe weather especially Sunday night and early Monday morning. But today over the next six hours, it's going to be hazy, hot and humid. It's going to feel like Florida out there. 79 at 10 a.m. will quickly shoot through the upper 80s so that by 3 o'clock we're at 89 degrees and it'll feel like it's in the lower 90s. As we take a look at future cast right now, 9 a.m., you can see some of that cloud cover quickly burns off so that by 5 o'clock this afternoon, mostly clear skies can't roll out the chance for a straight pop up shower or thunderstorm, especially along the ridges by this evening and midnight. Most everybody has cleared out, although it still will be muggy. And by tomorrow morning early by noon tomorrow, still nice clear conditions, but you can see clouds will be on the increase ahead of that next cold front, which will be on our doorstep by Sunday night. You can see nine o'clock. There's that front. Some of those showers and storms already making their way through central Ohio by Monday at 2 a.m. You can see a lot of those storms off to the south and the west and for your commute on Monday morning. It looks wet, stormy, could have some enhancement of those storms, especially over the ridges. Your Monday morning commute does look wet again, could see some severe weather, some of the flash flooding, which we have seen over some of those areas, especially south of the city could be hardest hit yet again. But by midday Monday, as you're back to work, most of the rain starting to push off to the east and things will finally start to clear out and calm down. Temperature wise, as we go through today, you can see 72 by 9 a.m. Those temperatures quickly shoot up so that by tonight, if you're headed down to the Pirate game, we'll be at 84. It'll still feel like uh, summer out there with those high heat index values. By tomorrow morning, 73 degrees and temperatures tomorrow will stay a little bit lower than today because we'll have more cloud cover as that cold front approaches just 82 by tomorrow night. And what you'll be able to see as we put this into motion, that cold front quickly blasting through with those showers and storms so that by 9 a.m. Monday, we're in the upper 60s and things will finally start to calm down. So your forecast looks like this, mostly sunny, hot today. Again, can't roll out an isolated shower, especially east of the area. We'll see a high of 87. If you're headed down to the Pirate game, taking dad for Father's Day, partly cloudy, warm and muggy. We'll be at 80 around first pitch and tonight. Partly cloudy, warm and muggy again. We'll dip to 69. Still feel that some of those areas inside the city will see lows remaining in the lower 70s. Your five day forecast looks like this again, partly sunny with some afternoon storms on Sunday, especially later in the day. So get those outdoor activities with dad out of the way early. We'll see a high of 89 77 on Monday with a chance for thunderstorms, especially early in the morning. Beautiful day on tap for Tuesday. Mostly sunny, much lower humidities. The best day out of the seven days upcoming. We'll see a high of 78 before our next chance for rain rolls in here on Wednesday with a high of 78.